Hello, I'm Kyle, and this is Ask an Engineer, where we answer all of your questions about concrete and foundation repair. And I know you want to know more about that. So, let's go. Today, we're talking about sinking concrete. How does this happen? Well, it's probably not news to you, but pavement doesn't go very far into the ground. It sits very close to the surface. So maybe the question should be, why is the ground below my concrete sinking? Well, there are three main culprits. The first is poorly compacted soil. Concrete should always be placed on soil that is well compacted. When it isn't, in the first few months or years after construction, that soil can tend to settle away in poorly compacted areas, leaving empty spaces or voids underneath the concrete. This is especially true when the builder needs to dig trenches, which are often need for placement of utilities, or in the case of up against a garage, a footing. There has to be a trench put right at the threshold of the garage opening to place a footing. So right in front of a garage door is a very common place to see a sinking slab. The second culprit is called consolidation, which kind of sounds like the same thing, and in a lot of ways it actually is, but all soils over long periods of time will naturally consolidate. So even after 10, 20, 30 years, the soils will continue to consolidate, creating those same voids. The third culprit is something called washout, and that's exactly what it sounds like. Water finds a way to travel underneath the concrete, and when it does, it scours out small amounts of soil material that are supporting the slab. This happens slowly at first, but the more soil that's removed, the more water flows. So this is an effect that accelerates, and it can happen at any point in time. Now, however these empty spaces got below the concrete, the slab will eventually follow. The important thing to know is that ripping out the concrete and starting over is not your only option. There are many times where these problems can be fixed. And if you want to know how to fix them, tune in next time on Ask an Engineer and we'll talk all about it. In the meantime, drop a comment, hit the like button. I love it when you hit the subscribe button, but come back here and we're going to talk about how you fix sinking concrete on the next episode of Ask an Engineer. We'll see you next time.